Hi guys, welcome to another video. In this video, we're going to test Samsung DeX on Samsung Galaxy S21 Ultra. Let's get started. First, what is Samsung DeX? DeX is short for Desktop Experience. What it will do is it will make your S21 Ultra Android OS to have the same layout as a desktop computer. But before we can use Samsung DeX, we need a USB-C docking station. The docking station should have HDMI port as well as USB ports. We'll use the USB ports to connect a wired keyboard and mouse and the HDMI port to connect to an external HDMI display. We can also use Miracast to connect Samsung DeX via wireless connection and also we can connect wireless keyboard and mouse but for this test I will go to use the wired connections okay let's try to set this up Okay, this is the desktop layout of Samsung DeX. As you can see, I'm using a mouse here as well as a keyboard. The wallpaper is the same as the one set up on S21 Ultra. At the upper left corner, we have the application icons. The lower left corner is something like the start menu. But for here, we have the application menu. And also the recent home and back buttons at the lower right corner we have the time the battery percentage the Wi-Fi connection at the same time if you click this this is also a quick settings and also we have the sound control here let's try to open application try to open Google Chrome okay as you can see here this is the same as the Windows desktop screen. You can also use the button here to minimize the window and also to maximize it and for this one to close it. You can even use the same shortcut key as the one on the desktop computer, the Control T to open a new tab. Let's try to access YouTube. Okay, let's try opening another application. Let's see the multitasking. Let's open the Play Store. Let's maximize it. Let's go to top charts. And if we go back and forth using Google Chrome. Going back to the Play Store, as you can see, it's really a true multitasking. Next, let's try opening a game. Try to maximize it. As you can see, you can make it full screen. And we can also press the window button plus D to minimize it. And we're expecting that the game is still running in the background, even if we minimize it. And if we go back to our previous application, you can see that the tabs are still there. So, 
Android OS multitasking is really really good. So there you go guys. Do you think this can replace your desktop or laptop computer for everyday normal use? Please comment down below. And please don't forget to hit that thumbs up button and subscribe to my channel if you find this video informative. And see you on the next one.